So today we're just a tick over 100 degrees uh, in the shade and uh, that's not going to stop us from doing an unboxing today. So a box arrived today from Big Bad Toy Store and they have their $4 flat rate shipping that returned and um, that's a really good excuse if you have never bought from Big Bad Toy Store to try them. Um, I've been dealing with them for about 20 years now and I have never had a problem and I've spent thousands and thousands of dollars in the store and like I said never had a problem. So what we have here is the uh, Marvel Select reissue of the Juggernaut. Now this, hands down, is the best version that I've ever owned. Um, and I've owned the Build-A-Figure. I still own the original uh, Toy Biz version. And I've owned uh, in the past this Select version when it first came out. And um, I had sold it because at the time I needed some cash. Now I picked this up for, I believe it was $26 shipped. Uh, if I remember correctly, they had them for $22 and then $4 shipped. Such a great figure. Uh, just the size alone makes this one worth picking up over any of the, any of the others. And, um, you know, again, if you could pick them up for under $30, um, unless you're buying the build of figures for the, the figures that come with it. If you're going to go on eBay and buy just the build of figure for $50, don't waste your time. He's a bit smaller. Um, a nice figure, but not, in my opinion, not as nice as this one. This is just a really good figure. Um, I'm going to go ahead and try and open him. I don't know. I see like some of the parts just to keep the plastic on are actually like plastic riveted in place, which is kind of neat. It tells you, it tells you how hefty this figure is. I've also pre-ordered um, Thanos that came back out with him. So if any of those figures you had missed and uh, want to avoid markup prices, uh, you can do that by pre-ordering these figures now. And I'm not trying to do a big bad toy store commercial. I'm just you know, being honest that uh, if, like me, you sold part of your collection off or just uh, never got them or are new to the hobby, um, you know, we're going to pause it here. I'm going to go get some snips and cut these wires. All right, so we got uh, Kane Morco out of his confinement. And um, like I said, he's very heavy. That's, that's the first thing you notice about him. I mean, the articulation is certainly not up to Marvel Legends standard, but I think with a character like this, it doesn't really need to be. The idea is just heft and uh, bulk. To give you an idea, I went and uh, the first figure I found was Phoenix. So to give you an idea of the size difference. I think in this case though, uh, Juggernaut uh, may be outmatched. But that's alright. The idea here is just for size difference. Um, again, Marvel Select version is definitely the way to go. So that's what I got today. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you later. Bye. Keep watching for the next video. Come back soon. Bye.